yeah this is this is the perfect wine lip i could say hey guys it's nice to see you guys again welcome back to my channel i was actually debating on whether or not i should be doing some reviews on youtube so i just decided i decided to just try it out anyway i'll be reviewing some labiote labiote lipsticks from korea i was really lucky that i had a friend who was going to korea thank you gia for getting um the lipsticks for me because i've been actually looking at these lipsticks for a long time ever since i saw sunny dahe dahe Ever since I saw Sunny reviewed on her channel and she did a haul and she went to the store then her friend Kim Dao also had some of these lipsticks and there were so many great reviews about it and the packaging is just so cute and I really wanted to see if it smelled like actual wine because that's what they said it did. My friend got it from, for me from Korea last year and I wanted to make a review for you all because maybe you guys want to get that yourself maybe you guys want to try it I remember when I was picking out the colors I was watching every YouTube channel review just to see like how it would look like on the certain skin type how it would look like um, when it's worn rather when it's swatched because um, it's really different when you see it in a picture let's get on to the recording <laughs> okay, let's get on to the review. So these are my Labiata lipsticks. I'm so happy that, you know, they arrived and they're here and I still can't believe it. Like even when I see it and I use it every day, I still can't believe it and I'm still using it. So I got two colors. Just so you know, they're both the fitting kind. They're more velvet in texture. And they're, they have a lot of different colors. This is the original line. This is a limited edition line. They also have another kind of lipstick that is more like more moisture moisturizing. I read some reviews that it was it wasn't as great as the, the fitting version, so I decided to get the fitting version. So the colors I got are RD or RD01, which is Be Candy. <laughs> it's burgundy, so this is uh, the net, the like if you want wine stained lips, this is probably what it's gonna look like on your lips. Then this one is Darling Mat Motu Darling Mood B E O two. So this is a uh, like a pinkish beige. Um, the original line has a lot of different colors. This limited edition line came out. With only four colors, so B01 to B04. This is the two. I have they're all in the like my lips but better um, range. So some are more purple, some are more brown, some are more orange. I went with the one that's more pink because my lips have a natural pink hue to it. And when I don't have lipstick, I look really dead, and this really helps me a lot. So before we start, let's put lip balm. So. Ah! So pretty. So this is the Labiate. Pretty. I'm saying it the same way Sunny says it. The packaging is so pretty. Like I super love like the matte cap. Like this is so Instagram worthy. It's so pretty. It looks like an actual wine bottle. It says here Chateau Labiate wine lipstick. And here is the color and everything. In the front, it has the wine lipstick Rouge à lèvres. Rouge à lèvres. So. The top comes off. Now this is a cushion. Can you see the cushion? To achieve the gradient lips for those that want just the inside to be darker than the rest. And this is the lipstick. I've actually kind of used it already, but that is the color you get. It's a really nice burgundy shade. From the get-go, it looks very matte. Like I was really scared. I was really scared it would come out as super dark super and very flaky but I was surprised it didn't so let's try it out oh my god that's just one swipe and they, it's so pigmented it is like super pigmented there see ya? I just put my lips together and say this is the burgundy I love the color on my lips it's so pretty and it feels really good on the lips. It feels moisturizing. It doesn't feel matte. It smells like wine. When I put it on my lips, I could actually already smell the lipstick. And I love the color. It's so pretty. Really great for night. Because of the color, the pigment, I don't know if you can see. There. Can you see? 
it's very plum. So just so you know, it does leave a, li a, a tint on your lips. So if you want to take it out, I prefer you use like some micellar water or cleansing water. I'm using this one from Minisol, the Aloe Cleansing Makeup Remover, and it works really well. See, there's no color left, but my skin, but it's really dry, so I have to put them all again. It is the same shape, but the difference is it has a shiny cover. So this is really girly, really pretty, and still same cushion. And then, of course, it has this color. I've used this so many times already. <laughs> there, so that's the color. It's like um, it's like a nude. It's like a nudish pink, lightly coral. Let's try it on my lips. So. This is my number lip color. I really don't have any color in my lips, so this is like it looks really natural. So the formulation is so nice, it's so creamy. And it smells so good. I remember wearing this for like six hours straight. A little of the color was off already, but I just reapplied it and it looked great. Pigment is super great, feels great on the lips, it looks great on camera. I'd say it's good for every day. Definitely good for every day. Good for work, going on maybe a date night. Be good for evening too if you have like heavy makeup on top. I feel so bad that this is a limited edition. I would have loved to get like maybe two of these and use them for a really long time because finding a My Lips But Better lip color is really hard and this is definitely my top favorite amongst the ones I already have. This is definitely a winner for me. I got both of these at 795 pesos. So that's around maybe less than $10. And it's a, it was a buy one, take one promo. I would definitely recommend the La Vieta lipsticks. You can buy them in the Philippines, but try to buy them from a, a legitimate seller. Just double check. It's, it's better if you get it from Korea because you know you're getting the authentic product and you're gonna save your lips a whole lot of trouble. I hope you guys enjoyed my first makeup review on this channel. I haven't done a makeup review in the longest time. Um, and I do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. I would love to have those thumbs up. If you think that I should continue doing these makeup reviews here on the channel, on, the, on my channel, leave a comment down below. Um, if, are, are there products that are worth buying? I'd love to know. Just, just leave, the, just leave it in the comment section down below. So subscribe to me, click on the bell so that you get notifications once my video is out. I had so much fun doing this makeup review and I really really love these this lipsticks. And I hope to see you guys soon. See you in the next video. Bye guys!